I am Joseph of Sirad, Joseph of Masad, farmer, cotter, plowman, Sahugani, summoner. Nine years ago, I destroyed the village of Saran with a power I could neither control nor understand. A power passed down through generations for thousands upon thousands of years. A power I never asked for and never wanted. Nine years ago, raiders attacked Saran. To save my village, I unleashed the demon and the demon massacred all in its path. The raiders, my friends, my family. The survivors blamed me and who else were they to blame? I wore the ring. I called forth the demon. And so I left the ruins of Saran in exile and outcast. But I was not alone. My companion was a vagabond named Iago, an old beggar who had come to Saran the year before looking for the child born with the mark of the summoner. Looking for me. Iago said he'd teach me how to use my gift, how to use the ring that only those born with the mark could use. And now we were both vagabonds, hated and feared. We came to the village of Masad, and I threw the ring down a well. I told Yago to go away and never trouble me again with talk of prophecies and destinies. I was finished with my power. I swore on the graves of all who perished in Saran that I would never summon again. But the one thing I tried to escape was the one thing that came looking for me. And that is where my story begins. The year was 596 Borno Mediva. 300 years after the Medivan conquest, 1,000 years after the fall of Ikemos, and 12,000 years after the Third Arenageth and the death of Urarth, god of the Sudani. Murad the Usurper, Emperor of Orenia, a realm far to the north across the sea, invaded the shores of the Kingdom of Mediva. Led by the infamous Four Riders, Murad's soldiers laid waste to the villages along the Dahu River. One night, they came to Masad. The soldiers were looking for a boy with a mark on his hand. The mark of the summoner. 